Hi guys, this time I have a Gucci handbag here. I don't um, usually buy Gucci for some reason, um, especially the vintage ones have been very, very problematic, <laughs> especially the lining. I have had a lot of problems with the interior of um, vintage Gucci and um, every time I would uh, purchase a vintage piece, there is always a flaw and I would end up spending more on the refurbishment or restoration of either the either li either the lining or um, the surface scratching and all that. So I just find it to be like not so good investment sometimes because um, I end up uh, paying more for the restoration. Okay, but I just couldn't help but... Um, um, get this uh, piece it's a i would say um a micro is it micro gg but the one of course that um made me buy this was the buckle in front which is somewhat like um blondie it's like a blondie but it's not actually a blondie um emblem for gucci so uh, i'm not sure what they call this but it's just so huge and I just love it. I love, love that um, Gigi um, hardware buckle logo in front. Okay, so um, this looks like a bucket bag, but it's actually not. It's, it's, it's just that the, the, the structure of this bag looks like one. And so it has a, an open top with just this flap um, closure um, snap. Uh, in front so I would say this is a medium handbag so this is ideal for you know just uh, casual <laughs> casual to semi-formal or just about anything you can use this handbag for any you know anywhere <laughs> okay so okay let me just show you this is what they call the um, the GG that looks like the blondie because I've always been in love with the blondie but um, I haven't seen one yet that uh, really, really, um, I don't know. I've always lost it on the blondie, but may maybe next time that will be my next purchase. We'll see. Okay, so there you go. So that's the front. This is, of course, coated canvas. And this is in brown, of course. So this is a vintage, a uh, vintage piece. What I like about this, this is that the thing is in here, made in Italy. Twenty three by Gucci. So this is a vintage piece. All right. So um, there are oh jeez, I had the water eight ounce water bottle there, so this sits nicely here. Okay, so. I'm a very minimalist when it comes to my bags. I only have my card, my moisturizing hand sanitizer, and some tissue paper. That's all I've got. So as you can see, there's a massive, massive thing here. I've used this last Sunday to go to church, mass. And the interior on this one is actually better than um the other gucci vintage pieces because this does not flake or peel off so this is like a cloth or fabric and it has one zip compartment so that's where i put my card and my love don't be shy <laughs> um thingy so yeah so there you go it's yellow 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 so you won't see any any gucci thingy stamping there because it's already on the buckle and the belt so yeah uh the only thing was uh, of course there's um like um scuffing on here on this side but it doesn't bother me at all i can i can have this uh actually recolored if i want to but doesn't bother me at all it's, it, it should be okay shouldn't be a problem there's just a little bit of uh, thingy here but um, yeah, so 
the bottom is just like this um actually the design sometimes you won't even know if it's vintage because the vintage designs have been like um uh, re been resurrected again so it's like no i know this is a vintage piece okay so uh there you go it's beautiful guys there you go bye